Hi, in today's video I'm going to talk to you about body postures and public speaking and why body postures are very important for your presentations. According to Tony Robbins and professor researcher from Harvard University, Amy Cuddy, power poses are important to boost your confidence. The idea is to stand up straight, to take up more space, and putting your hands on your hips like Wonder Woman, and to smile broadly to indicate confidence. The same body stance that they teach police women in the police academies. And there must be a reason for that. The basic idea is by consciously positioning your body in a more confident body pose, what will happen is you will feel more confident, which will make your mind follow. So if you stand and smile confidently, you'll feel more confident. Research shows these body stances cause your body to release more testosterone and less stress hormone called cortisol. And that is why you'll feel more confident. So if power posing makes you feel more confident, why not use it? The second part about body language and public speaking is not only how your body postures make you feel, but how it makes other people feel, such as your audience. Researchers show that openness of speaker's body language and your proximity to the audience will increase a positive reception of the speaker and the speaker will result in getting a higher rating. So when preparing to give a public speech, before giving that presentation, you should practice your power poses, your body language, your gestures. It'll make you more confident and during your speech, you should focus on staying open, moving towards the audience as much as possible, but don't actually sit on the audience's lap. That's kind of weird. So, learn to speak well and successfully. In addition, you need to take into mind, into account the content you'll be delivering and figure out what to wear, what kinds of clothes you should wear that are best. Practicing your speech and your body language and posture will train your brain to ensure a good result during the actual speech. And one thing is for sure, if you avoid thinking about your body language and posture and you leave it all to chance, well, the result of your presentation will be mediocre at best. Check out our upcoming videos about public speaking and communication skills, stealth and sales negotiation strategies. Leave your comments in the box below because I'd really love to hear from you. Don't forget to subscribe and again, thanks for watching and have a wonderful day.